Well, today is the last day to cast your ballot early in the primary runoff election, and one race for a traditionally low profile seat is or at least it should be on your radar. The Republican runoff for railroad commissioner, one of the bodies that regulates Texas energy, which is something most of us are thinking about after the freeze of 2021 and grid concerns in an unusually hot May. Now, this race has been full of twists from a candidate tragically dying in a car crash to one posing almost nude in an ad and another, the incumbent, being accused of corruption. Those last two are now headed to a runoff. In March, Wayne Christian earned 47% of the vote. Sarah Stogner earned 15%. But the underdog says her campaign is gaining momentum, and her experience as an oil and gas attorney makes her the better candidate. Inflation is, in is affecting us all, right? And I think over the past probably 25 years, really, we've had a lack of transparency in the industry. And so what I want to do is bring transparency and let the subject matter experts address the issues, get the bureaucrats out of the way so that we can fairly enforce the regulations that are on the books. They're sufficient. We just have to enforce them fairly. It shouldn't be pay to play and it's become pay to play. And I want to bring back you know, actual property rights and, and respecting property rights and small government and fiscal responsibility, like the true tenants of the conservative platform. And that's what we really need in the Texas energy industry. Now, I'll have my full interview with Stogner on the KVU YouTube channel. We hope to also let you hear from incumbent Wayne Christian, but despite working to arrange an interview, he stopped responding. Remember, most polls close at 7 p.m. tonight. Election day is May 24th. Brian.